so hey guys we have a new discord channel um for for you guys so if you're interested link is down below check it out peace Hello amazing people, it's Tivi here again. So today we're gonna look at the Astromon, um, the new event monster, the Grab Bag. Um, the Grab Bag is a 3 star monster for all element that includes light dark. So for, um, for the people who are interested in getting the light and dark version, you have to go to the uh, shop right here and you buy them with 2,000 Astro Gems. Are they worth it? So uh, let's take a look. Um, let's look at the RGB first. Uh, da, 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 da. Searching, searching. Uh, okay, it's a balance type with Borel Boost. In my opinion, this is not a really good monster. I mean, Burrow Boost does give you SP. Like, when I look at these monsters, I look at uh, how I would use it. Um, Healer is definitely f mainly for, for me, it's right now for Titans. But I don't see any use of it. Um, maybe if you need to clear uh, Golem, that might be useful. But for everyone who are past that stage, uh, you don't need it and for for me actually I actually really like the siren for the um, for the wood dungeon because um, siren can actually soul tank and you could actually get three uh, fire fire type and it'll kill the wood really quickly and your siren can just solo tank everything and still heal your team so for that, I'll prefer the Siren over this because the Siren you capture like every day anywhere. So fire for me is a no go. I mean, there's not that many good fire healers, um, so it's not a bad I <coughs> it's not a bad idea. Uh, there's only another another healer. I think it's the is, no, this is not the healer. Uh, is this the Siren and the Coutine? So if you don't, if you and, and the mini cat, but it's not that great. So if you actually do need a healer, you're desperate with a healer. I guess you could get it. I won't recommend it though. Uh, for the water one, we have no. Uh, we have a no. Uh, critical hit. Uh, when you have a hundred percent crit. You will be late game, and you when you're late game, you don't need this. Skip. <laughs> this, however, I think is not a bad monster. Um, attack up is definitely really good on Titan. Let me look at the stat. Uh, uh it's not bad. You could probably jam it HP, HP, defend. Or maybe defend, defend, HP. Because for Titans, I don't know. For Titans, defend is better than HP because when you could heal yourself, having more, uh, having more defense is definitely more beneficial. Um, attack up is really good. What that means is that your heal will be activated whenever the bar is full instead of uh, when you actually need the Astromon to heal. So the wood one in my opinion is actually the best one. I could actually maybe use this in Titans. Um, the light one, the light one I think is actually quite special. Uh, is a 3 star light tank. Uh, I mean, 3 star, if if you look at these, there's no 3 star that I complete beside this one because I, you, you get it on the event, like, you get so many of them, and these are like capturables. 
Um, but this one, I think this is one of the best one out of all RGB light dark. Um, because it's a tank, it restores own HP and it has attack up. And for a lot of people who saw my um, PvP PvP videos before, you know that I love the the light Venus. Uh, where is the light Venus? The light Venus. And if you can see, the HP isn't that much. There's like three K health different, or is three K health different, or is it the same? Oh, it's the same health. But then you have a lot lower in defense. Yes. 118 versus 25. That's huge. That's 700 defense. So that is. That is like a 1 defense gem. So. It's a lot weaker. It's not as tanky as it is. But you still have the amount of HP. So. It's not horrible. And it's a tank unit. It has um, self sustain. I think it's pretty decent. Um, the Phoenix is, is I I only got like uh, four Phoenixes uh, during the event. It was back when I was still a noob, and I actually managed to holy gleam all the way up to Evil Three. So it it it, it uses me like half a year to get the Phoenix, and the Phoenix is so strong. And for this is it's not. It's not as good as the Phoenix. I mean, the attack up is really nice. So if we're going this, we're going for two things: tank, the tankiness, and the healing, as well as the attack buff. Let me look at the heal. Seventeen, huh? It's not too bad, to be honest. It's just, it's just the attack up. So. If we if we are buying the package, we are getting the light one instead of the dark one. Um the dark one is actually quite disappointing. Um it's basically a weak weaker version of the dark cupid. It has um similar skill, aggressor and shield, but the shield is only for is, is only a shield. Um, for the Dark Cupid, I recently got mine. For the Dark Cupid, it's actually scaling to your max health. So um, the shield, we have we have three different shields. We have the shield for max scaling with max health. We have a shield scaling with max level, and we have a shield. And um, the Cupid, like the one who scale with the sh uh, max health, is definitely the strongest one. So this guy, he level. 3 star with weak no is if you don't have the cupid i guess you could get it i don't suggest you to i think definitely the dark, the light one is superior to all of the other and then the wood one and then the dark one and then the fire one and then the water one <coughs> so and keep in mind when you buy, when you do purchase these uh, astromon they come in in evil what do we mean new healer? They comes in in like um, evil evil one version. So you still have to get fifteen Ashramon to level it up. So it's not it's not easy. Look, when does they expire? They have five, we have twenty two days until it expires. So we're basically gonna farm as much as possible until the end. Let me do let me do clan battle. So that is actually my opinion. Oh rip. That is actually my opinion for the um, RGB. Um, and yes, the fusion. <coughs> um, this event is not just about the the capture event. Um, they're important because you could actually complete these and turn one of t turn turn your nat twos into nat threes. That's those are really beneficial. For example, the NASA they recently just buffed the NASA. I think they buffed all three of these: uh, the NASA, the Loki, and the Fiki. Um, the NASA I think right now is one of the strongest Titan monster 
could, you, could, you have is a really strong debuffer um, tank type which is really good <clears throat> 70% for attack down and defend down that for me is one of the best is one of the best debuffer for sure yeah for the water one is really good as well um, but the, for the water one we're gonna look we're gonna look at the low key the low key I think I missed it I must have okay it's right here it's just below they change it to a predator um, <coughs> it is a really strong unit if you look at the attack I mean <clears throat> if you're new to the game definitely grab it if you're if you're a late gamer you don't need it but might as well get grab one for clan conflict or something it does crazy damage with hunter and predator <clears throat> it won't be super op in titans however but um if you have more than enough resources definitely grab grab one of them yeah, so that is it for the champion, the champion Astromon review. If you like, click here, 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 here. I, I don't have anything yet right now. Yeah. Peace.